Welcome to UCMDB 10.30 What's New, featuring event-based discovery. Cloud configuration systems provide end users with the flexibility and agility to self-provision and delete components at the infrastructure as a service and platform as a service level. This flexibility leads to frequency of changes in these environments being in minutes. The existing UD discoveries are primarily schedule-based and are unable to keep track of dynamic changes in cloud environments, which can potentially lead to negative impacts on end users. The objective here is to provide the ability to continuously and accurately represent highly volatile public hybrid private clouds and virtualized environments by listening to events from systems managing these environments. With a new event-based discovery solution, we can enable Dataflow probe infrastructure to subscribe to events from cloud management systems, enable Dataflow probe to listen to events of types, create and delete instances, and enable Dataflow probe to immediately create or delete topology in UCMDB based on received events. We will now demonstrate event-based discoveries with a short video. In this video, you will see how to configure an event-based discovery and run event-based discovery against OpenStack to create and delete an instance. In UCMDB 10.30, the new event-based discovery support two platforms, OpenStack and VMware vCloud. In the discovery jobs, you can find the new jobs under the cloud category. For OpenStack, the events are captured from the Rabbit MQ server embedded in OpenStack. The manual AMQP for OpenStack job can be used to discover and create the MQ server CI. When the MQ server was discovered, it could be used as the trigger CI to invoke the OpenStack event monitor job. You can use this job to connect to the Rabbit MQ server and keep receiving operation events from the OpenStack. For example, when you launch an instance in OpenStack, there would be an event published in the OpenStack embedded Rabbit MQ server. Such events would be received by the OpenStack event monitor job. Upon reception of the event, the job would parse the event information and create the corresponding node CI in UCMDB within 30 seconds. In addition to creating the node CI, related information would also be updated in UCMDB. including OpenStack image and flavor based on which the instance was created, as well as the IP address. Besides the instance creation event, the event monitor job can also handle the delete instance event. In case you do not expect the physically removal of CIs accordingly to events, there is a setting in the event monitor job to control whether to remove the node CI immediately after the reception of the remove instance event. Note that we have introduced a new setting in the adapter. Now you can configure the maximum execution time setting value to zero, which would enable the event monitor job to keep running on the probe unless you manually stop it from the UCMDB admin UI. 